All right, the question was ask, asked, how do you remove a border from an image you're trying to engrave? So say I'm engraving this image and I want to remove the border. Typically what you'd actually do, I mean, it doesn't have a border. Let's just say the edge is our border. Uh, typically what you do is you'd use an image editing, editing program and then you just uh, process your image and then put it in here. But if you actually want to use Meerkat, we can, in fact, do a sort of crop here using a tool that uh, Jay Pernay came up with for keyhole images. So let's do editing, image splitting, and then uh, keyhole image. Now we select both the uh, images. So we select the image and the rectangle. I held control to select them both. Uh, the keyhole object we want is the last object here because I want the rectangle to be the keyhole. So the keyhole is the last selected object. Uh, we don't want to invert here. And then, uh, then we say create key keyhole image. And now it will create a keyhole image, which is located there. That's just the cropped rectangle. And this is now the cropped image. However, this uh, tool is actually more powerful than this. And it's uh, specifically supposed to be so let's say we wanted to do the same thing but we want to do it with a circle uh, same procedure uh, select both although in this case uh, last selected is correct so then we say uh, create the keyhole image and this will now be the keyhole image if instead we wanted to for some reason edit off piece of this image we would uh, go ahead and say, uh, let's do a rectangle here. And then say we wanted to remove this bottom part of the image. Then we select this image and this image. We select them both. Uh, our rectangle is the keyhole object. And then we say invert and then create keyhole image. And then that creates this as the keyhole image which is actually the uh, full image above that. So it just cropped this section off. So say you ran a raster and you uh, bottom the top, but you just need the top of the raster and you know where everything is or whatever your use case is. Uh, and that's how keyhole works. And it works for any complex shape, so long as it uh, would draw. All right. Uh, Thanks for watching. Okay. Okay, if you're still here, there's a funny little kind of Easter egg hidden feature thing. I'm going to go ahead and go into console and type harmonograph. This adds a harmonograph widget to the scene. And basically all I need to do is click next a bunch of times until it does something cool. Let me hit X. And now this is added to the scene. And I can go ahead and uh, run this as a vector, which is actually pretty cool. Thanks for watching.